guys it is pretty so we are back and as you guys can see right there we are level 999 the grind is over I just popped into a couple of uh, matches I got myself I think I need around 2000 XP but we're gonna do something special for this last match until we are now the max level in Black Ops 3 so what we're gonna be doing is we're going to be going in, as you guys can see right now, I have a six man lobby, and we're going to be doing the one man TDM win. So basically, all five of them, Sync Exposed, we're at Krish, JSOL, Toxic Poison, and Easy Trapping, we're basically going to be going into the TDM match. They're going to be sitting in spawn, just basically camping, and I'm going to go out on my own as a 1v6 and just try to win. So, you know, one man TDM win. So, let's get right into it. Let's find a match, find a TDM. This may take a, a little while, guys. Uh, I'm not too sure how long it's going to take to get a match. Because uh, we're not looking for Nuketown. If we play something small, we don't want a small map. We want a good map. Actually, maybe something like Havoc or something like that. But we can't have a small map because we. the thing is, we don't want them to die too much. If they die too much, that makes it harder for me because then I need to get my kills faster. So basically, I will be right back with you guys once we get into a lobby. Alright, what is going on guys? We have now just found a match. We're playing on Metro. We got my 5-man, 6-man team. They're basically just going to go around. Oh, we already got someone right there. Alright, nice. They're basically just camping right now. And I'm trying to goal is for me. Okay, well there's our first death. Death, not off to a great start. 1-1. One one. But the goal is for me to win the game only by myself and they cannot get any kills at all hold on let me get a second there okay so basically they can't get any kills at all and i'm just playing solo by myself going i'm not too sure how the challenge goes oh one sec i got two kills all right there's a two piece on, let's just get all right there we go okay so mid map is uh definitely somewhere i don't want to go you guys just saw the right there. They're actually, all just sitting back there. But that's exactly what I want them to do. Oh, thank you, sir. Five and two. We are probably very close to my level 1000. Six and two. Now, the thing is, we do not want the enemy team to find them and start getting streaks. Otherwise, then we're done. Uh, I'm not really going to go for the 100 kills. Let's just punch this guy. Yeah, there we go. I'm not going to go for the 100 kills. I'm just going to go for the L. I'm not going to go for the L. Oh, there it is. 1,000. We are now level 1,000, everyone. The grind is over. 1,000. Let's keep going. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. Let's keep focusing. Hold on. Let me kill this guy. Before. There we go. Okay, this is very difficult, actually. Eight minutes in, and we're only at ten kills. I'm not too sure how this one's gonna work out at all. Actually, I'm not too sure if we're gonna get. I know we will get a W. A nice little two piece. Just pull up the sights real quick. And oh, I just turn on, and I get shot from the back. I'm not. I don't think we're gonna get the hundred kill win though. Although, because we are very low on time. All right. So you guys are probably wondering why you guys just skipped all the way to the end of the gameplay but what happened is uh this challenge a bit it's a bit more difficult than i thought oh there's a nice two piece but it's a di bit more difficult than i thought just because of how slow it actually is i basically run to mid map the whole gameplay you guys would be watching that guy's afk the whole gameplay you guys would be watching was uh there you go here's the two piece nice little one one sec there's a couple more Alright, there we go. Oh, oh. Alright, so basically, uh, the whole gameplay you guys were just basically watching was me running the middle of the map, getting three, four, five kills, something like that, and then just dying and just repeating itself. Three, four kills, die. Three, four kills, die. Run to the middle of the map. Oh, three. Where's the quad? Where's the quad? There he is. Do we have enough ammo from him? No, we don't. Let's put it away. But uh, yeah, it was kind of just a very slow gameplay. And we are barely winning here. And we had one mistake. A random joined. And he did get three kills. He has three kills right now. So it is kind of a fail. This was a first attempt to fail. Not really a fail. We might actually win it. So I guess you could say it's a win. I kind of did get the W here. But uh, that is all guys. 
I will see you guys over on the other side to show you guys my stats. Alright, so we are back in the lobby, guys. I hope you enjoyed that one-man TDM challenge win gameplay. I went for you guys for the first time ever. It didn't go necessarily all as I hoped it would. Uh, enemy team, they got wrapped somehow. I'm not too sure how. I think it's just because they found out that my teammates were shooting at all. So they kind of just strictly avoided me and went for them. So then they ended up getting full streaks, wraith wrap, all of that. And then what happened as well is my one friend, he found a good hiding spot. He got too comfortable, went on his phone, forgot to play. And then he got kicked from the server for inactivity. So then a random player joined and took his spot. So then he got three kills, which kind of ruins the challenge of the whole thing. But if he didn't get those three kills, it would have been a tie. But then again, he did get four deaths, so minus those four deaths as well. So I think we did take the uh, the W challenge somewhat complete. I'm not too sure if the challenge is to actually get 100 kills or what, but I'm not too sure. That was just the first attempt. Just write down if you want me to do more challenges similar to these. And uh, I'll make separate videos for that. Anyways, we're going to be going through my stats, my finishing stats at level 1000. We're not actually going to be finishing multiplayer, not at all. But the finishing stats at level 1000. So my leaderboards, my classes, um, let's see, my full out stats, how many nuclear medals and whatnot like that. So let's get right into my stats first. Alright, so we have a 2.73 KD. Actually, let's go by public match stats. 2.75 KD, 179,000 kills, 2,200 wins, 19.1 million score, 577 score per minute, and a 1.07 win loss ratio. Not too bad stats at all, I think. But let's get into my weapons. I know some of you guys care about this. So, we have 63,000 kills, my VMP. You guys probably know which gun is my absolute favorite. And then it drops all the way down to 18,000 kills. My Razorback, second favorite. And then even lower to Vesper, Weevil, Man of War, Kuda, M8, all of those. So for my specialist, if you guys care about this, I don't have too much of a high kill per game. Just because I'm not really spawn trapping. I don't spawn trap too, too much. I mean, I do, but I mainly just pub stomp. So that's why... I have uh, lower kills per game, but for kills per game, that's actually good for just a normal pub stomper. Uh, for nuclers though, we currently have 21 nuclers, only one of those, and 65 unstoppables, and only one of those was uh, from spawn trapping. So 20 of my nuclers are me just running around legit. Now, the best part, the 9 prestige emblems you unlock at level 1000. They look absolutely amazing. So you get the prestige 10. Nope, prestige, wait, is that, yeah, that's part of it. Prestige 10 for from Black Ops 2. And then you unlock the pr Master Prestige Emblem, Prestige Emblem from Black Ops 2. Prestige 10 from Black Ops 1. Prestige 11 from Black Ops 1. Prestige 12 from Black Ops 1. Prestige 13 from Black Ops 1. Prestige 14 from Black Ops 1. Prestige 15 from Black Ops 1. And you earn the Prestige 10 from World at War. So I'm just going to go ahead right now and actually choose which one is going to be my favorite. I'm not too sure. They actually all look the same. But I already kind of thought of it. I think I'm going to go with the Prestige 14 from Black Ops 1. Because it just looks amazing. I've seen other Master Prestige people do it. So this one I'm rocking. I hope you guys don't like those 9 new Prestige emblems. But now, this little uh, crypto key situation we have going on. I currently have, I think, somewhere over like 4,000. One sec, let me check real quick. Alright, so. How much do we got? Yeah, we have 4,221 crypto keys. And guys, expect the video right after this um, video or the next one. I just wanted to save it for 1,000, but it's here, guys. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Level 1,000, guys. Thanks for all the support.